Hello there, welcome to my video. Recently, I came across Jordan Persegatis videos. I really hope I pronounced his name correctly. I'm sorry if I didn't. And uh, in these videos, he turns some quite wholesome coloring books into amazing horror art pieces. And as I love art and I love horror, it goes without saying, I was totally inspired. Also, here it is uh, carnival season, so it could have been more fitting as a video idea. At least, I think so. And here I am. I found this coloring paint online and I started my attempt to transform this cute depiction of Disney's Alice in Wonderland into something creepy and sinister. Without further ado, let's get started. As you can see, I am using Krita. Uh, create a software for the digital painting process. From here on, I don't really have much to say if I want to be absolutely honest with you. I simply make adjustments to the original line art and then I add columns and finally I add some very much needed details, in my opinion, of course. Okay, bye, see you next time! I'm kidding. The truth is that I am not used, like, at all, to narrate or and commentary to a video I make. And for that reason, I have only posted spin paint videos or painting time-lapse videos, if you will. But today, I decided to step out of my comfort zone and try to talk a bit more, just for once. Back to the drawing. The idea I have, I had, it was to make Alice look like a zombie-like creature or a zombie or a zombie-like, you get it, sitting inside the open mouth of a carnival plant. And, of course, there should be blood stains, of course, and just a little bit of fake blood make, makes everything bit more scary. Always. Now that I think of it though, when it comes to horror slash thriller movies, I'm not getting scared by bloody scenes or gory flicks for that matter. Okay, in some cases maybe I get disgusted by some really disgusting scenes, but that's for another video. What I am really scared of in this kind of movies is things that I cannot see or things that have a typical and normal or even good appearance. What I'm trying to say is that sometimes the horror and even the evilness is where you least expect it to be and that in my opinion is truly terrifying anyway if you are still here and i didn't bore to you today i really hope that you enjoyed this video Honestly, what did you think about it? 
should I make more videos like this? I would love to hear Turin, sorry, your feedback for the painting or for the whole video or whatever else you would like me to know in the comments down below. Till the next time, if there is any of course, thank you for watching.